How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. Series 15 has just been revealed and in this video I'm going to tell you everything you need to know. So if you do find this video helpful make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any Horizon 5 update videos, information videos, leaks, all that kind of stuff. Let's jump into it. Now this update is a little bit of a different one just like last year they have actually combined update 15 and update 16 which is in January because the developers are off over Christmas so they put both updates into one so it's out the way and the developers can have time off. There will be some series 16 information in this video but I will probably have a separate video for all of the series 16 information whereas this one is just series 15. So we're going to start off with the festival playlist and all of the cars within that. Now there's six new cars this week, four of which are in the festival playlist and two of which are outside of the festival playlist. More of that in a minute. So obviously this series is holiday themed because it's Christmas and we can see that there are holiday themed festival playlist special events as expected. So let's start off with the splash screen of the festival playlist. We can see for 80 points we can get the Extreme E number 22 and for 160 points, the Ferrari California T over the entire series. You'll also see on the right-hand side, Secret Santa is returning. I'm gonna explain the Secret Santa after the festival playlist, and Secret Santa has changed a little bit, and we know the rewards. So we're gonna move on to the first week of the festival playlist, which is summer, which starts on the 8th of December. For 20 points, you can get the AMC Javelin, and for 40 points, the BMW M3 GTS. The AMC Javelin is one of the new cars. Forza Von Shop on that first week has stuff like the Lotus Elise GT1, Porsche 911 GT2, a red nose, reindeer antlers, and the Jingle Bells car horn. I'm going to leave on screen now some screenshots of the rest of the challenges available that first week. On to the second week, which is autumn on the 15th of December. For 20 points, you can get the second new car of this month, the Plymouth Fury. And for 40 points, the Dodge Super B. The Forzathon shop that second week has stuff like the Ferrari FXXK, the Ferrari 365 GTB, an elf hat, an elf outfit and deck the halls car horn. I'm going to leave the rest of the challenges available that second week on screen right now. The third week which is winter which starts on the 22nd of December for 20 points, you can get the third new car of this month, the Caddy Limousine. It's pretty cool to see that back in the game. And then for 40 points, the Mercedes-Benz 300 SLR. The Forza Don Shop on that third week has the Lamborghini Veneno, the Aston Martin DB5, a Santa hat, a Santa outfit, and the Ho 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 car horn. Rest of the challenges that week on screen right now. The fourth and final week for Series 15 is Spring, starts on the 29th of December. For 20 points you can get the fourth new car, the AMC Rebel, and for 40 points the Porsche 911 Gunther Works. And the Forzathon shop for that final week has stuff like the Pagani's on the Sea, the Mercedes-Benz truck, green outfit, a yellow sundress, and the clock tower horn. And last but not least, here are the challenges on that final week. So that's the festival playlist, there are four new cars within it, but as I said right at the beginning, Secret Santa is returning for this Series 15 month. Available until January the 5th, 2023, Secret Santa is a special holidays horizon blah 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 blah. I'm not going to read it all out, you get the gist of it. If you were here last year, you know exactly how it works. Basically, us as a community, we need to work together and send gifts to each other within the Forzathon shop and the gifts drop sort of feature that's already in the game. Once we all collectively gift each other, eventually we will reach certain thresholds and unlock rewards. They've noted that they have actually tweaked it compared to last year. They have tweaked and adjusted how it works based on your feed our feedback last year. So we'll find it easier to unlock the snazzy top tier cars. Now we actually know what both of them rewards are. We can see that the 50% reward here is the holiday tree outfit and the 100% reward is a new to Forza car. And this car here 
is the Lamborghini Sian. You may remember this was one of the cars that was announced on the Torben Tuesday last week. We managed to crack the code. It was a Lamborghini Sian. Now we know how we're getting it. It is the reward in the Secret Santa. So let's all work together for the month of December and get that Lamborghini. Now there was another car within the Torben Tuesday that we know is coming because we, we figured out the clue, but we've not seen it in this update yet. And that is the 2022 Cupra Urban Rebel concept. We know this is coming because it was a clue and we actually are getting it this update. Very simply, this car will be distributed for free to everyone who's played Horizon 5 either or on before December the 7th. So if you've played Horizon 5 before, we're gonna get this car for free straight away. From December the 8th, we can redeem this from the message center. So the Cooper Urban Rebel concept is coming and it's basically coming to everyone for free. We don't have to do any challenges or anything like that. It is coming. What is missing though, is the third Torben Tuesday car, the Nissan Z, or there's Nissan 400Z, we're presuming it's gonna be. That isn't in this update. It's not in series 15. I'm going to be pretty safe to say we're probably getting this car at some point. Absolutely guaranteed. There's no reason why they would tease it if it's not coming, but it's not in series 15. Okay, what else is in this update? We have the evolving world returning. Obviously, the Horizon Wonderland theme around the whole world is returning as well. We can see on screen a bit of information about what's what's going on they are doing exclusive for the fun shop sales on two specific days as we can see here there's going to be a christmas day sale and a new year's sale if you play horizon 5 between these two dates we will get an exclusive forza fun shop which has exclusive rewards just on them sales I actually have these screenshots of the sales right now. This is the Christmas Day Forza on Shop sale. So if you get on on Christmas Day, this is what the shop will be like. The Lamborghini Sesto Elemento Forza Edition, 911 GT3 RS, the Santa stuff, a Zenvo. Pretty cool cars in there for very cheap. So make sure to get on Christmas Day. And then we have the New Year's shop as well. If you go on it, you will have the Pagani Huayra Forza Edition, R8 V10 Plus, 458 Speciale and the Jaguar CX75. They've also made it clear that they are bringing back clothing and car horns, which were previously seen last year that you can now regain again. Here are some of the clothing which are coming back. If you miss them, you can get them. Here are some of the horns that are returning. If you miss them, you can now get them. There will also be another opportunity to unlock the song Language by Porter Robinson for your Horizon mixtape radio dial. There will be opportunities to unlock previously released 10 year anniversary songs in the future. Um, stay tuned for that. But in the meantime, we can unlock the language song in this update. And then last but not least, if I can find the slide, there it is. We have a few bugs and fixes. An event lab build point has been added to the Horizon Stadium and then a few other bits and bobs as you can clearly read on screen. So all in all, not a bad update to be honest. There's, it's what we expect for Christmas. The cars coming are pretty cool. I'm looking forward to the C and specifically, it is a shame not to see the Nissan 400Z. Um, we're probably gonna get that in the future. As for the Series 16, this is what we know so far. As I said, I'll probably have a separate video about this mainly, um, but Series 16 is going to be called Ford. Zathon, not Forzathon, Fordzathon. Um, it's not going to require an update because it's all going to come out in this update as one combined thing. Ford Sathon will introduce a festival playlist themed around Ford events and rewards, as well as two new to Forza MG cars and three Renault cars returning to Forza. And we also get a list of what those cars are going to be. Um, straight away, it's quite weird that it's going to be a Ford update Ford events but there's no Ford cars that makes me think that I'm going to wait to comment on series 16 until we know a little bit more about it in my next video because there's lots missing about that this video is just series 15 so make sure to let me know in the comment section below what your favorite thing is about this series 15 update leave a like if you've enjoyed subscribe if you haven't already for more content just like this and I'll see you all later